some kind of medicine. Uh, I'm on the hunt. I'm on a hunt. Pick it up. Anna Correa. Guess she must have been a patient here. And what's this? Actually, oh, wait. You see the tape. Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak. 1547, Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. There's a guy. You need to brace yourself, Anna. The Molly confirms that you're pregnant. beat the crap out of. Oh god, oh god, oh god. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm gonna give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. I don't want the procedure! I want my baby! I can't do this! I can't do this! Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow. Or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. Damn it! We almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. Lee, maybe there's another tape. We gotta keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one well, of the walkers out in the alley by the other body. Shop. Maybe you should search him. See what he's got on him. All right. Oh, now we gotta go back. Gad Zooks. Which way was it? It was this way. Yeah. I'll be right back. I gotta use the bathroom. Can't run. In here. Oh, snap. What the hell? Was that Molly? Drop the TV on his head. Ah, here we go. Mm, mm, there. Stomp. Search. This might be just what we need. And what's this? Looks like some kind of code. But Vernon said the safe combination was only four numbers. Mmm, locker. Okay, time to go. Shit, time to go. That's what I said. Okay. Gotta be that locker. This one. Locker. Another tape. Safe combination has got to be on one of these. Okay, progress. Good. A 
found two more tapes. One of them is dated October 10th. That's the day after the first one we watched. Put it in. Oh, I'll put it in, alright. And you'll like it. Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically you do. You can terminate the pregnancy, or leave Crawford. Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. Maybe that's best. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive? To keep on living? If this is what it takes. If this is what it's turned us into. I don't make the rules, Anna. Doctor, I'm begging you. Please, help me. Maybe one day, when things are different, you can try again. But for now, today, we have to do this. Yeah. No. No. I think we know what happened to Crawford. More importantly, we got the combination. Yes. They got what they deserved. Looks like the sick system these bastards cooked up to protect themselves wound up destroying them. Can't say I'll shed too many tears over it. We're in business. Antibiotics, morphine. We'll take as much of this as we can carry. Okay, I think we're good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. You know, I found a third tape in the locker outside. Maybe there's something else on there. We got the meds for Omid. That's <sighs> all I care about. We'll head back to the classroom. Don't take too long, Lee. Let's watch it. Oh. Listen, as fun as this was, I have to put a stop to this little rant. Uh -huh. This is the last I can give you. Why? Oberson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. He's really cracking down. I just can't risk it. We had a deal. Yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. My sister needs this medicine. Without it, she'll die or she'll start showing symptoms and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah, that's the Crawford way, isn't it? Well, shit. She was sleeping with him. I'm guessing that other lady was Molly's sister. That's why she hates him so much. Jesus Christ! Oh, what the oh, you fuck? The shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. I'll take that battery now. Oh, yeah. Uh, about that. I'm just kidding. Here you go. What's that? Nothing. You lied to me. You lied to me. What? You said you'd never been here before. But that wasn't the truth, was it? What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. You were having an affair with that doctor. I didn't lie. I asked you how you knew about Crawford. You said you just heard stories. I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You saved my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth? 
Are we really gonna do this now? I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was 14 years old. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place, earn their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic, and by Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. I kept it a secret. Kept her safe for as long as I could. But in the end, I couldn't protect her. That's when I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked. How anything was better than becoming one of them. But I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late. Before they came and took my sister away. This is all I have left of her. I didn't have time to take it before I... I don't care. I just wanted it, okay? I don't care about your life story, Molly. And maybe you shouldn't have asked. It's just that me and my people, we, we got our own problems, you know? Yeah, well, who doesn't these days? What the hell? I think that's our cue to get the hell out of here. Here we go. Oh, Jesus! Chip! Man. Sorry, sorry. I just got spooked by those bells, and then I heard someone coming. What the hell were you doing out here anyway? Kenny and I still can't get the door open to the armory. He sent me out to look for something we can use to bust it open. I found this. Uh, Ben? Where did you get that? Oh, the door. It. it was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there. Oh, no. Oh, shit! Ben, you freaking idiot. Oh, oh, she's, she's got it. All right, all right. Thanks. I didn't have enough time. Good going, kid. Nice shot. Oh, the kid did it. What is going on? They're coming. Oh shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Come on, damn you! Because it's my fault, all my fault. What the hell's he babbling about? Ben, we talked about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean this is all your fault? Kenny, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever uh, you did, save it ben, for life. Ben, shut up. No, no, tell them. Tell them. Fine. Go ahead. Tell them. It's been me all along, putting all of us in danger. Katja and Duck, it was all me. It was all me. Got it open. What are you saying? Oh, it was crap. me who made the deal with the bandits at the motor inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck... Mm -hmm. Uh, kick his ass later. Kitty man, I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. We gotta focus on getting out of here. You little pissant! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dead! My wife and child! You gotta both fucking kill! Kenny, listen to me. You can whip a skinny little ass later, but right now we gotta go! Nice group you got here. Not the time, Molly. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! Put it to a You boat. hear me, shitbird? You can stay behind and fucking rot! Kenny, I know you're upset. I understand. But you don't get to make a decision like that on your own. We're all in this together. We're a group. Sure! Take a vote! This is America! Fuck it! But before you all decide, there's something you ought to know. The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's got to get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here! Well, I vote we leave him. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well. But all I want to do is get back to Omi, and you put that at risk. 
Wait, don't I get a vote? Crap. Uh, okay, yeah. Of course you do. And it's nice. He's my friend. We don't leave friends behind. That's my vote. On second thought, I think I'm gonna abstain. Lee? Uh, we cut him loose. I'm sorry, Ben. I've got to do what's best for the group. That means cutting you loose. Yeah. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a second? Oh. Um. Well. Um. Well, there's three. Oh, her guts came now out. Now can we go? Damn right. Vernon, come on! Close it, close it. So much for the armory. What's left of it? A few rounds. That's it. You didn't close that door behind us? I could. The lock was busted. Great. Just fucking great. Come on. There's got to be a way out down here. Uh, not that way. Fuck! It's not going to hold. Back upstairs! I got a shotgun. Hey, look! Mm. Oh, no. Uh, press S to key, S key to get away. Oh, was I too slow? Ah, oh, crap. Okay, 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 I got it, I got it, I got it. S, 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 S. Meh. Ah. Crap. Uh, oh no! What the fuck? Don't stop shooting. Oh crap! What the fuck? Shoot! Shoot! One. Two. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. What? What the? What? I didn't see her. What the hell? Damn it. Damn it. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Gotcha. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Mm, what? 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 Oh shit! Go up! Go up! Damn it! Oh crap! Let's try this again. Okay. 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 Up! 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 Pull your leg out. Oh, what? I got it. I got it. Free the leg. Look up. Kill. Can't waste that first bullet. Can't waste that first bullet. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I'm ready. Free leg. Try to at least. Look up. Shoot. Free leg. Look up. 
shoot. Free leg. Try to free leg. Look up. Shoot. Try to free leg. Free leg. Uh, shoot. Shoot. No. What? It was Ben, wasn't it? Oh, it was Krista. Okay. Excellent. She's cool. She's cool. This guy, this guy. Come on! Oof. Come on, Lee. It's all right. I'm fine. Exciting. Any way out of here? This leads to the roof. We might be able to find a way down from there. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? Yeah. Why? Walkers. I can see the sewer where we came in from here. I think we can do this. Well, what are we waiting for? Go, go! What about the train? Yeah, come on, let's go! Pull him up. Let's see what happens. Oh, we saved Bin. I don't know. It seemed interesting. It'll lead to some drama with um the group. Krista, everything okay? Oh me. Is he okay? Uh, stay away from him. Is he dead? I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Krista, get away from him! Uh, hey. Back already? He's fine. We got you medicine. Good. Feel like I could use some. You okay, kid? You look worse than I do. We almost didn't make it out of there because of this asshole. Uh -huh. Should have left him behind, but we had the chance. Guys, what the hell happened out there? Let someone else tell you. I got work to do. Okay, with a little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes. Thank you so much. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk in private. Uh-oh. What? Uh... So you'll be going? So you'll be returning to your group now? Yes, but not before I give you a piece of my mind. What? You don't think by now I got you figured? You don't strike me as someone who has a lot of consideration for others. Look at what you did to get me to come here with you in the first place. You expect me to believe you give a shit that it wound up costing Bree her life? Now just hold on a damn minute. Listen. No, you listen. You got some good people here and they look to you as their leader. Well, I'm here to tell you the kind of leader you are. They're not gonna make it much longer. 
And you're kidding yourself if you think putting them all on a boat is going to solve anything. Now, you may not care about all of those people, but I know you care about that little girl. Which is why I'm going to make you an offer. What kind of an offer? I'll take her off your hands, take her back with me to my people. We're well supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us have had kids of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer mm. than she will be if she stays with you, I promise mm. you. That's what you Walk want away, for, Vernon. isn't it? To be safe? I'm gonna pretend you didn't say any of this and give you a chance to walk away. Which you ought to do right now. I know you think you're doing what's best for her. And if you were her real father, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But you're not. And staying with you is not what's best for her. If no one else around here will tell you that, then I will. That little girl's in my care. We've been through more together than you can imagine. Anyone who tries to get between me and her, anyone, is gonna wind up dead. You hear me? Nice. Take your hands off me. Punch him in the gut. Ow. Oh. Hey, going somewhere? Yeah, I'm about to head out. I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything. It's been fun. Mm, so that's it? So that's it? After all we've been through, you, you're just gonna leave? Yeah, I figured you don't owe me anything. I got what I wanted in Crawford, and I never did like the water. Where will you go? I don't know. I'll figure it out when I get there. What do you want me to tell the others? Tell them whatever you want. I'm not real big on goodbyes. Tell Clementine she's going to be okay. You've got a good one there. She reminds me of me. Bye. Kenny's working on the boat. I know. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? Crap. Uh, some place else? I don't know. I don't know. We'll figure it out. We always do. Clem, honey, what's wrong? Is Ben going to be okay? He doesn't seem the same since he got back. Hmm. It's his own fault. He's just feeling down right now. Truth is, he brought this on himself. What do you mean? Look, Ben's a good kid. He means hmm? well. He keeps trying to help. But every time he does, he winds up putting the rest of us in even more of a jam. What happened to Kaja and Duck? It feels like he was responsible for that. Because he is. The fact is, he's right. He was. But you still saved him. Yeah, I still saved him. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? Uh, yes? Sure, we'll look before we leave. Really? You'll take me to Crawford so we can look? <sighs> I knew you didn't really mean it. <laughs> Reach out. Everybody in this game needs a bath. <sighs> Clem. 
Clementine. Hmm. Gone. Clementine. Where is everybody? Clementine? Clementine! Oh god. Her hat. Talkie. Uh oh. I don't trust this thing, this cardboard here. Check it, check it. Oh! Ah! Oh! Uh, act, act, act fast, act fast! Got him, good. Yeah. There you go. No. 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 Oh, I've been bit. safe. I did. Lee? Where's Clementine? She's not in her room. Vernon ain't in the house either. What the hell is going on? Whose blood is that? It's a walker's. Fucker jumped me from behind. So where's Clementine? Clementine's gone. I found her hat and her radio on the ground out here. That's all I found. There's no chance she just wandered off on her own? No. No way. Then who the hell took her? I don't know. It's that guy. Last night Vernon came to me and Offered to take her with him. Or Vernon. So be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Hmm. I'll go alone. Clementine's my responsibility. Can't ask any of you to risk your lives over this. This is something I have to do alone. Lee, man, are you sure that's how you want to do this? I'm sure. This is on me. One else. Thanks for understanding. It's better this way. We'll get the boat out onto the river. Figure we can wait there until you get back. Or at least until nightfall. Good luck, Lee. I mean that. Yeah, man. Good luck. You too. Hmm. Maybe I should have uh, shown them my wound. Would have been more dramatic. Oh well, too late now. <laughs> Empty. <laughs> ah. Where the hell are they? Vernon, get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. Close the door. Clementine, are, are you all 
right! Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch! Who is this? Who is this? It's not Vernon, if that's what you're thinking. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. Oh, I will. You're fucking dead! Last episode, no time left. Oh, no preview? Hmm, let's see. 73% of players brought Clementine with you to Crawford. 19% hid the bite. Who came with you? 6% went alone. I'm in the minority. That's fine. That was fun. So there's one more episode left. Uh, I'll play it soon. Until then, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys again next time. Bye! I'm gonna use the bathroom, drank a lot of beer.